My name is Don Harvey, and I'm a territory manager for Chefla. One of the lines that we represent is the Myrie line. And the Myrie line is a great example of affordability and incredible image quality. I'm going to take you through the X5, which is an, um, a, a cone beam unit that can produce anywhere from a 6x6 six six to a 10x10 10 10 field of view, which is enough to capture the maxilla, the mandible, the airway, all in one shot at high resolution. So let me go into our software here and give you a view. So as I go into the screen right here, this is an actual scan that was taken on a 10 by 10 view. As I look at it, it gives me the ability to look at a pan, an axial view, a really nice orientation of the skull and nice cross-sectional views. So for example, if I wanted to place an implant, I could simply click on a certain area and it would give me a nice cross-sectional view. If I wanna measure that in the software, I can go to my tools, my measure, I can go to the crust of the bone, click a button, go to the floor, and it gives me a direct measurement. And if I want to do the width, I can do the same thing, drag it across and drop it. At that point, I know what my measurements are for depth and width, and it would be very easy for me to determine on the fly if I could place an implant in this. If I want to get rid of it, I simply right click it and click delete on each one and they're gone. Another great feature a lot of people are getting into right now in dentistry is, is sleep medicine. And having a field of view that's large enough to capture that is important. So not only do I have enough to capture the maxilla and the mandible as well as the thirds, as you can tell from my axial orientation right here, I also have the ability to go through and get the entire airway, which I can see in my axial view and my cross-sectional view. If I wanted to go and segment out the airway, all I would simply do is go to my tools and click on new volume. And this would allow me just to click right on the airway and give me a very nice representation of what the airway looks like. I can see the esophagus, I can see the epiglottis, I can drag my box to get all the way up to the upper part of the airway. I can change my resolution to high resolution if I want to at my discretion and simply click next. At this point, as long as I'm inside the parameters, it will fix. I wasn't at that time. And that's one of the really great things that way you don't make a false reading. So again, I just drag this down. I get to the area that I think I need. I look at all my cross sections to make sure I'm in the right area so I can fine tune it here. I'm good here. At which point I would simply click my next and it's gonna calculate the volume for me. Now, as a dentist in Texas, you obviously cannot diagnose sleep apnea, but this gives you a nice screening tool where when they have a sleep test, they can use this as a screening tool to determine whether or not they wanna move forward with an oral appliance, which is one of the great things that we can do in dentistry today. Again, in this case, this person has a massive air volume and there would be no need for me to do that. All I simply do is save my results and it brings me back to my 3D field of view where I can show my patient what their airway looks like along with their maxilla and their mandible and again, all the way back to the thirds. If I wanna go in and look at this 3D volume, because it's the eye candy, I can double click on it. And there's all different kinds of things I can change. If I wanted to do like a bone and soft tissue, I could click a button and go to a bone with their soft tissue. If I wanna get rid of that and just go back to what I was doing before, I can go to my transparent bone, or I can go to gum. It just really, at the click of a button, I can pick and choose what I wanna do. So it's my discretion. It's one of the things I really like about the software is it's, it's easy to use. It's, it's easy to go through and sit down with a patient. You can make determinations for endo, for implants, and for airway at the click of a button.